All right. Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing. But now let's talk about Solana. You know, before we get into the Solana's update, yes, I know, I know I have not been giving you guys these daily updates as I was pretty much pretty much for the last four to five months daily updates but you know there comes a time where you do need to take a little bit of a breather but i want to give you guys an update that i'm officially back we're back on schedule so smash that like button hit that red subscribe button if you have not already i appreciate each and every one of you guys' support day in day out but Let's talk about Solana. See what is happening with the price of Solana right now and of course what is yet to come. So, Friday. Wow. This is exactly what you want to be seeing, um, especially on a day like Friday. We're seeing a significant amount of green across the board. You can pretty much see literally everything right now is up. And of course, that is due to Bitcoin making a bounce. You know, BTC back above $42,000. Huge, huge, um, you know, plus point uh, for the entire market. And as far as Solana is concerned, it's up 7.3%. But there's a lot of things happening for Sol. So we're going to talk about that. All right. So. If we're looking at the price of Solana right now, it's sitting at $93.10. Uh, like I've mentioned, it's up 7.4% over the past 24 hours in USD comparative. It's also up 1.7% in Bitcoin comparative over the past 24 hours with the market cap currently sitting above $40 billion and the 24-hour trading volume currently sitting at $2.1 billion. Absolutely amazing to see. But before we go any further, as always, just a quick disclaimer, anything on this channel is not financial advice. Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in cryptocurrency. So, you know, as far as Solana's ecosystem goes, guys, you know, at this point, it's no secret. Uh, you know, the amount of significant, uh, you know, developments that are coming out of Seoul is just so much that you cannot even keep up with it. You know, we're seeing Jupiter, uh, you know, coin that's finally launching next week. Highly, highly anticipated launch. And, um, you know, they launched a few test coins and some people you know, got a few thousand dollars worth of these test coins for absolutely free. And, um, you know, Solana really is out here changing uh, lives because, uh, you know, what we're seeing happening right now is a shift, you know, a global shift in my opinion. And this is something I saw coming before uh, a lot of uh, attention was on the Solana ecosystem. You guys can literally go watch my old videos when no one was paying attention to Solana. You know, I was talking that, you know, I could see Solana actually taken over because you know the way if you've used their blockchain if you've actually interacted with the Solana's ecosystem you know how much of a game changer it is and now what we're starting to see is masses are starting to realize that so great as you can see some news right in front of us Bybit is going to list Jupiter on the 31st and again this is just the first centralized exchange that has come out and spoke about this and of course, I made an announcement and I think this is going to get bigger. So I think moving forward, we're going to see more bigger centralized exchanges such as Binance, Coinbase. I don't see why they wouldn't. You know, they, if they're listing Gito, why would they not list the biggest airdrop on the Solana ecosystem, which is for Jupiter? So this is, of course, great news. And you can see this for yourself, the WEN token. This right here is the meme coin. That is launched um, by the um, one, another team along with Jupiter's help. They're trying to test the overall launch pad. And you can see this for yourself. When token did launch earlier today. And, um, you know, they gave away about 634,000 um, of these tokens each to everyone. So everyone got a fair share. And um, as of recording this update, your overall, uh, you know, allocation, if you did qualify, is uh, for about $60 US, which again is free money. That is free money. So great to see. And you can see this for yourself when flips both Bonk and Mock Jupe in 24 hour DEX volume. Absolutely insane. But again, not a surprise at this point. And moving forward, you can see this for yourself. There's a guy named Nassim. This is absolutely insane. I want you guys to take a very, very close look at this. So Nassim, 
he put a hundred thousand dollars and again this guy is absolutely crazy absolutely degen you can see this for yourself he put a hundred thousand dollars into when token when it initially launched and uh it went up to almost a million dollars <laughs> absolutely mind-boggling stuff but uh going forward you can pretty much see you know there's a lot of things happening for uh the solana ecosystem you know some people were selling their allocations earlier yesterday so things are looking absolutely insane and like i said you know there's so much going on right now that you just cannot keep up with it but let's take a look at the price but before we look at the price i want to kind of go over some things that i uh want to discuss so you can see this for yourself 22 hours ago only I asked you guys, I asked you guys, where do we all see the Solanus price at the end of this year? 3,000 votes have come in, and let's take a look at the result. 35 people, I'm sorry, not 35 people, 35% 35 of the 3,000 votes uh, are uh, hoping for $250 at the end of the year. And 15% are thinking, uh, you know, $1,000 plus what do i think now you may be asking in my opinion i think it's going to be higher than this 250 um you know before the year comes to an end i'm just very optimistic like i said you know if we're looking at the developments that are coming around and if we hear any announcement regarding an etf coming it's absolutely going to be a game changer in my opinion and i think we could see all-time high sooner than a lot of people really think and not only that i want you guys to take a look at this sorry so this right here is quite funny, and I'm pretty sure a lot of uh, people found it funny, 129 likes, but basically you can see this for yourself. You know, usually when the price is just going absolutely insane, that time there's less people that are talking negative about the project. You know, usually that's the case, and um, you know, you can see this for yourself. It's a meme. It says, I should have bought Solana at lower prices, but when the lower price actually comes, when the retracement actually comes, the amount of people that are actually willing to purchase the coin is way lower compared to, uh, you know, people that are willing to purchase that at a higher price or regretting it uh, when the prices are just going absolutely insane. And this is a, our, the way our brain thinks. And it's quite strange, in my opinion. I've always said this. It's quite a strange way uh, we all think. And this is why, you know, there's a saying, be greedy while others are fearful, be fearful while others are greedy. The people that are greedy during massive uncertainty are the ones that do well. And speaking about that, that is exactly what we saw happen. Um, and let me tell you guys something absolutely insane. So we did see, um, if you watch my Solana update, which was about like a few days back, I talked about this target exactly at $80. We touched that target right on dot. You cannot make this up. Uh, and then, you know, of course, if you had some buy orders placed in around here, you saw a significant bounce, of course, uh, as uh, did the entire market. You can see this for yourself, a 17% increase. And let me tell you guys something. Around this price point, the amount of people that were talking negative, the amount of uncertainty there was for Solana, it was at its all-time high, in my opinion. And, um, you know, there's some people that are saying that Solana, you know, we're waiting for uh, $3, Solana, we're waiting for $7. Let me tell these people those times are gone you know these flutters are gonna come this happens every single time every single time there's these flutters that come you know that have uh, missed their opportunity you know that opportunity that they had and um, you know when they miss that opportunity then they you know talk negative you know try to talk other people out of it you know try to create FUD and this is where you do not want to get um, shaken out you, know, you want to have uh, your diamond hands. And speaking about diamond hands, you know, making an exit strategy meanwhile, uh, because like I said, um, without an exit strategy, you will get burnt out. So it's really important, um, you know, to lock, lock in profits on your way up. And of course, have an exit strategy uh, to know where you're locking these profits. But beautiful, beautiful bounce that we're seeing right now. And would not be surprised if we do see the price of Solana getting back into the uh, 38 point, I'm sorry, the 61.8 Fibonacci retracement level. Of course, we haven't been there since the 17 so that would be lovely to see the price pushing back up and of course we're seeing btc pushing up right now seeing quite a bit of resistance coming in the way and if this resistance is able to break we could be seeing btc back up to forty three thousand six hundred eighty five dollars in a snap of a finger so this is showing us right now that the cme future did get closed and I'm speaking about the cme future if you watch my icp update i spoke about that the cme future is closed i'm expecting a bounce and we have seen that love seeing what we're seeing right now let me know down below what you guys are saying let me know where uh you 
you see the price of Solana, of course, trading at, at the end of the year. And of course, what excites you the most about Solana? Love each and every one of you guys. See you tomorrow. Been Crypto ZX and peace out.